Hello, in this video, I am going to show you how to configure custom CSS for free Elementor plugin user. So you can see I am using the free Elementor version and using 2020 WordPress default theme. So I am going to show you how this custom CSS work first and then I will show you how to configure it in your free Elementor plugin. So let me create a section first and then navigate to advanced step and you will see the custom CSS option like this. So to do this, go to plugins, then add new and search for master add-ons. Once the search is complete, you will see master add-ons for Elementor by Jewel theme. Just install this plugin and activate and then you will see the master add-ons option panel. The option panel looks like this one. So you can disable all of this add-on if you don't need this uh, or you can enable if you like to use this add-ons but I will focus on custom CSS only. I have disabled particles and background slider for this add-on and only enabled custom CSS here and then save it and let's navigate to our work. So I will add a section and then let me add an inner section. Okay, let's delete one column and for this section let's add a background image okay this one okay let's add this and make the position center then default repeat no repeat size cover Okay, and now let's drag some element here, for example, heading. This is a simple heading text. Let's design the typo for color white and the typo. I love poppins. And then in EM, let's type for the weight 800, line height 2 pixels to EM, let us space 1, let's make it 5 or 6 and position this to center. And now let's do some code. Go to edit section, I am on the main section, then custom CSS. And then typing selector, okay. And now let me add padding. Four hundred and zero, okay and then transform transform skew 0 degree minus 10 degree okay we can see the output the whole section is skewed and now let's reverse back to our inner column and if you like to make this browser responsive then i recommend you to use webkit most os or ms and then let's navigate to our inner section and go to advanced step and this was by elementor pro that's why it's blocked because i'm using free elementor version and this is provided by master addons now let's select our and let's transform skew zero degree and ten degree. Now only the background, I mean the section background, it's reverse 
and is cute. I have placed this title in intersection and made the intersection in 10 degree reverse. That's why it's on default look. And you can see how this SKU system works with custom CSS. So this is how you can implement any custom CSS anywhere in your uh, column section or element section or main section. Also, you can add some custom CSS in your main page settings too. So this is how custom CSS works and you can also implement this custom CSS option by Bastardons in free Elementor 2. So I hope you like this video and thumbs up on this video and don't forget to share this with a friend and don't forget to subscribe in this channel.